first time I was here, it would have been 2007. This background of violence, of displacement, and of suffering and deprivation, the difference is that it's organized now, that armies have taken shape. You say Christian, non-Christian, Muslim, non-Muslim, and it's not about religion. It's really about people perceiving that another person is different, another person is other than what they are. And again, you know, people fled into the bush, multiple homes absolutely burned and bashed to the ground. And you know, you're looking into the eyes of the What would that be like? I lost literally everything. But I always remind my kids, whenever you see this terrible violence, you will also see more numbers of those kind of and on the, one of my teammates. And it's very much for sharing her stories. Aid workers, the teachers, against all odds, setting tears in the outdoors, accommodating so, so many children in the classrooms. For the kids, I ask, what do you want to be when you, when you grow up? It's your, you know, your dream. You're just a little, like, timid, like, what do you think? We're here today. And then, one after another, they began talking about what they want to be. I want to be a doctor. I want to be a nun. I want to be the president. And, you know, it's just like, they all had a dream. So, when I leave here, as in the other times I've left here, I leave with a tremendous amount of hope because of the children. I come away with that.